By the time of Star Trek the original series, Dr. Joseph Mbenga no longer serves as Chief Medical Officer of the USS Enterprise, and Star Trek Strange New Worlds Season 2 subtly set up this change. Klingon Ambassador Dakra visits the USS Enterprise, causing Dr. Mbenga and Nurse Christine Chapel to revisit their traumatic experiences in the Klingon War. Dakra had previously been a brutal general who was responsible for many atrocities during the war, and Mbenga tries to avoid Dakra throughout Strange New World Season 2 Episode 8. The Klingon ambassador insists on trying to convince Mbenga to work with him. Mbenga eventually snaps, killing Dakra. Nurse Chapel, who witnessed Joseph murder the Klingon, supports Mbenga's cover story that it was all in self-defense, and despite Pike's acceptance of Mbenga's story, Starfleet will likely still investigate Dakra's death. In TOS, Mbenga no longer serves on the USS Enterprise as chief medical officer, meaning he either gets demoted or willingly steps down from the position. Ambassador Dakra had become a celebrated ambassador for the United Federations of Planets. The Federation may not take his death lightly, which could lead to significant consequences for Dr. Mbenga. Throughout the first two seasons of Strange New World, Mbenga has struggled with apparent PTSD. Since his time in the Klingon War, Mbenga has chosen to focus on trying to save lives rather than take them. As much as he believes in saving lives, Mbenga does not seem to regret his decision to kill Dakra, but he will likely cooperate with any Starfleet investigation and may ultimately become the in-universe reason for McCoy coming aboard.